Since this uh, trapezoid is uh, subdivided into two triangles, we can clearly see that the area of this uh, trapezoid is sum of this triangle. That is, I'm marking one for the triangle ACB and for another triangle ACD, I'm marking as two. So basically the area of the trapezoid, just drawing as the trapezoid shape. So this is equal to area of the triangle one plus uh, area of the triangle 2. So we can write down that area of the trapezoid is equal to uh, area of uh, triangle ACB plus uh, area of triangle ACD. We know that the area of the triangle is a uh, half times the base times height and uh, this is the same for all the triangles. So let's substitute this. Uh, this is the formula to find the area of the triangle. So let's substitute this formula into this triangle. And when we use this formula, we have to determine the base and height of each triangles. Uh, for triangle ACB, the base is AB. And uh, the height is uh, we can say that this point is E. So C is the height. And similarly, now we find the area of the triangle using the triangle formula. That is the area of the triangle formula. For triangle ACD, uh, we consider the CD as the base and the height is, uh, it is CE. Uh, this uh, height uh, basically lies outside of this triangle which is uh, possible for uh, any triangle. So now let's substitute the values that we know. Uh, I put half for AB, I put uh, B and CE. You know that uh, it is uh, given as H. So CE is the height of the triangle. So we can represent H over here. Plus half of CD is uh, A and CE is H. So this is A times H. So this is basically half BH. If you write down in short form and this is half AH. Now you can clearly see that from these two terms, we can factor the half as well as the height. And then we will be left with uh, B plus A. Or in fact, I can write down this as uh, A plus B. So therefore, uh, this is the formula to find the area of the trapezoid. And uh, this confirms that uh, this is correct because we have actually divided this uh, trapezoid into two parts that is uh, triangle one and triangle two which are adjacent or which uh, lies inside the trapezoid. So basically the area covers the entire region of the trapezoid. When we add these two trapezoid uh, area of the triangle, it is basically equivalent to the area of the trapezoid. So therefore this is the formula to find the area of the trapezoid. Uh, we can convert this to statement as uh, half of the height times sum of the parallel sides. Because A and B represents the parallel sides, we can uh, write it down. This is the area of the trapezoid.